friends, welcome to the depth of chaos event. I will try one turn kill strategy to clear the depth of chaos rush with um, two heal. And this is my squad. I bring Rich and only build his abrasive form like this uh, with Mystic Knight's Turban, Ruler Chainmail. Zack's Gloops, Supernatural Subversion Materia, Wing Clipping, Sea Witch Slayer, as Striker uh, with his own Fusion card, and I bring Hyo. Um, his Bracive Form equipped with full set of Clash of Wheels gear, Prodigious Performer, Sea Witch Slayer, Control Strength with his premium vision card Ihana, I don't think we need to build her Aang with 2 3 stars accessory to reduce MPE consumption Kaito um, yep like this scanning googles yep. mm, indestructible like Heart Overcoming Headbird, Buster Style, Spectral Fields Forever. Um, will Vision Card? You guys can replace this card with any Vision Card that can increase his LB damage, such as KOG Vision Card, um, Ibarra Vision Card, I mean Ibarra EX3. Hmm. Yeah, we still have more, but I, I forget. <laughs> I forget about that. Okay, so here we go, guys. All right, so um, Ang will cast and water gun, rolling mist, clear sun. And now, Rich, Kaito, Hyo, has Limit Burst. Yeah, so every stage we just click reload and maybe on the final stage I will use Ihana to to use her LB to afford dragon kill buff.
Yep. So this is the final stage. Hmm. Like I said before, um, first I will click reload to make it simple. And Ihana cast limit burst because she has dragon killer buff. All right. So if your Ihana EX one, that it doesn't matter because on this final stage, her super limit burst will be activated. So here we go. All right, nice. Well, I hope you guys enjoy it, and hopefully, this strategy can be helpful. Um, well, let's see their damage detail. But here is is so vital on this strategy i i mean i i think i think um let's see oh yeah vote um deal 15 billion nice all right guys thanks a lot for watching this video have a nice day see ya guys